me Yana welcome back to my channel and if you're new here I like making videos on lifestyle getting healthy college vlogs productivity if that's something that interests you definitely go ahead and hit the subscribe button I post videos every Sunday and since it's summer I will be posting Sundays and Thursdays so definitely subscribe if you want to be notified when I upload I finished school and I am going to Florida I leave in a few days which I'm like super excited so I need to pack so I thought I would take you guys along and show you kind of how I pack for vacation um I'll show you guys like my suitcase and my carry-on and kind of like what I'm bringing um, and different things like that without any further ado let's get on into the video so this is like the stack of clothes that I'm like thinking of packing I'll show you my outfits and stuff in a minute but this is just like the stuff I'm using to pack and just like random things and I wanted to do a mini haul of like little things that I got so this is the book that I want to bring on the plane it's Brittany Louise's Taylor a sucky love story I just I watched Shane Dawson's documentary and like fell in love with her so definitely I'm gonna read that on the plane and then I stopped at Ulta today because who knows why and picked up a few things so my beauty blender is really gross so I just got the real techniques sponge um, just I figured to be fresh for vacation and then I got a Mario Badescu facial spray everyone's been talking about this and I wanted to try it out for myself so I just got like the little mini one and then also I got a travel size of the not your mother's beach babe texturizing sea salt spray i love this stuff so much especially after the beach or like after swimming or like showering i love spraying this in my hair and it just my hair is naturally wavy but this just like gives the most like perfect waves ever and it makes your hair smell really good it smells like coconut and it's really good so i got those three things and then also off of amazon i just ordered a camera case for my g7x nothing special just a camera and then my boyfriend got me this which i want to try it like changes your phone's um lens and i thought i would try it out and see like if i can take any cool photos and then i ordered this uh makeup bag from amazon it's like white and has cactus on it it's one of those like hanging makeup bags and it has like a huge compartment here a zipper one here a plastic one here and then you can hang it up so side note look how cute my summer background for my phone is oh and i forgot to tell you guys i got <laughs> these ollie goodbye stress because travel like stresses me out doubt that this like will even help because it's probably just like a placebo thing but vitamins are good like to take so i just got a mini pack there's five servings and so i'm gonna be gone for five days pretty much so yeah i just thought i would you know get some to have with me and these are at um the travel section at target in case if you're wondering they have like all the different ones but i just got stressed because i'm stressed um <laughs> But yeah, so basically I'm going to go and grab my suitcase, lay out all my outfits and swimsuits and stuff, and then we're going to get packing. Okay guys, so I laid out my swimsuits on the floor. I know it's kind of gro gross, I guess, but oh well. So I just wanted to show you guys because some of them are new and I think only this one is like an old one. I got this one. I don't think I ever showed you guys, but basically these three are from Shein and that is from Macy's. And I just wanted to show you guys because I never like did a haul. Um, but yeah, I have this one. This is one of my favorites. It's from Shein. It's like crisscross and then it has palm trees. It's a little bit cheeky, but not too much. The only thing about this one is that like the clasp comes undone like super easily so i like put tape around it i know that's weird but it actually works really well so that's my only complaint but i do love how it looks it just looks so flattering and then i got this one which is like ignore my carpet i need to vacuum but um 
this one like ties in the front it's like a neon yellow the camera is not doing it justice and these are just like really basic bottoms and it ties in the front this one fits pretty well the top is a little bit big in the back but um and i wish the straps could be adjusted but it still like fits the only thing though is i'm afraid of it like untying and like exposing myself but that's not gonna happen and there's this one which is really simple it's neon orange um but i love how this one looks it makes me look really tan um it's just a straight across bandeau which i really like and then these bottoms are high-waisted, and I love them so much. And they look like they're really cheeky, but they're not, like, super cheeky. Um, like, they look a lot worse than they do, or maybe I just don't have a butt. But, yeah, I think it looks pretty cute. And then this one I've had for a few years. It's, it was, like, a really, like, good brand. I don't remember what the brand was because I chopped off the tags and stuff. But the bottoms are just your standard... They're pretty full coverage, which I like, and I'm super comfortable in the swimsuit. And then this has cups, which I usually don't love cupped swimsuits. I like more like bandeau style, um, but that one is like super flattering for some reason. I don't know why. And then I have this gorgeous cover-up. It's so cute. I feel like such a bougie like girl when I wear this. It has like really pretty like... Um, detailing and the sleeves are super flowy and I love wearing this over my swimsuit especially the neon ones because it kind of peeks through and then okay this is like my situation so I'll just like take you guys through it so over here are like nice outfits to wear like out to dinner so I only have like two because I'm only gonna be there for like five days and then the rest are like travel days but i have like this romper um i wore it on my instagram and i just really like it and then i got this romper from romway or she no Shein. um but yeah i like it it has like this belt thing that i need to adjust um yeah it's just like this cute little blue romper and then i got this like bat winged cardigan to throw on over top of it um like during nighttime or something and then here i have like more cover up so i got this dress from marshall's it's just like a sleeveless like really basic it has like crisscross in the back and then this is just a simple black strapless romper that i like to throw over swimsuits and then here i just have tops so i have this like tube top that i thought would be cute and then then i have this like striped tank um i don't know if i should bring this like maybe i feel like i'm bringing too many tops like i'll never wear them all um and then i have this really pretty top it needs to be like steamed and ironed though but it's just like strapless like off or i mean it's like off the shoulder and super flowy and cute and then I just have a bunch of like just tank tops. I don't know if I'm going to bring all of them. And then I have like this crop top. I'm still like debating on what I want to bring. Um, and then I have sh some shorts. I think I'm pretty set. I have these like super pretty crochet ones. Just these black like distressed ones. These like denim ones. And then these like these ones are new. They're from H&M. And I'm obsessed. They have like a bow and they're super comfy. Here is like sports bras, bandos, like bralettes. Because like I don't like wearing normal bras, especially on vacation. So just bring like bras and bralettes. And then here are like my workout clothes because there's a gym at the resort. So I figured I would go. And then here is like super comfy like PJs. And then I could wear this to the gym and yeah. So just casual, comfy clothes. But yeah, that's like my whole like clothing thing. Hey guys, situation. sorry for like the bad lighting. It's like raining and stuff outside, but I'm pretty much packed. I'm using like half of this suitcase because um, me and my mom are, what is this? I don't know, but me and my mom are um, sharing a suitcase and then i just stuck my bathing suits in here i still need um 
to get like my underwear and like stuff i'll probably put it in like a separate bag just to keep it like sanitary and stuff um so yeah that's what i have going on in the suitcase and so i am pretty much packed like clothes wise um just got to put my shoes and then obviously like my computer computer charger phone all that i will just grab in the morning um and then my mom is packing shampoo conditioner and my toothbrush and stuff so yeah so i got my carry-on i decided to use this michael kors bag um i have like pads and tampons and stuff in there so far and then in here i have like vitamins hand sanitizer chapstick that stuff and then this is gonna go in there this will have all my chargers so far i just have my camera charger in there um and stuff i this is like a glasses case um then i have my book and my journal um i brought pens camera case and then here is like my makeup kind of this bag has like my actual makeup i'm not bringing a ton because i really don't need a ton because i only will be wearing makeup like in the evening or something uh but in here i have like makeup wipes in this little box i have my jewelry that i'm bringing i have a hairbrush lotion body spray um beauty blender here i have like all my brushes and then my mario badescu spray and i'm trying to like think i like wrote a list of everything that i need to bring um and i've been like going through it and checking it off i definitely recommend making a list because then you're guaranteed not to forget anything oops i just drew all over it but um yeah so i guess i am all packed so thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it and that it gave you some helpful tips on like how to pack or just sometimes it's fun watching someone else pack and like just seeing what they bring and stuff like that um and stay tuned for florida vlogs coming soon and also shout out to this week's comment of the day it'll be right over here so thank you so much for commenting. If you want to be featured next time in the comment of the day, leave a comment down below. Alright guys, thank you so much. I'll catch you all in my next video. Bye.